In this video you will learn how to share files from your Ubuntu desktop and access it from a Windows 11 desktop without requiring a username and password. To create a shared folder accessible to anyone, open Nautilus and create a folder you want to share. In this case, I will create a folder with the name anyone in the public folder of my home directory. Then right click the folder and select local network share. In the pop-up window, click the checkbox for share this folder. Once clicked, another window will appear and it will prompt you to install the Windows Networks sharing service. Click on the Install Service button to install the sharing service. Another prompt will appear and it will tell you that it will install the Samba package. Click on the Install button to proceed with the installation. On the next prompt, input your password and click on the Authenticate button. This will download and automatically install all the required packages for the Windows sharing service to work. Once that is done, you can name the share and then click the checkbox for guest access to allow anonymous logins to be able to access the share. You can also check this option to enable guest users to create and delete files to your shared directory. But for now, we will leave it unchecked. Now click on create share button. We also need to modify the permission of our home directory for other users to access our shared directory. To do that, click on the other locations at the left menu, and then click on the computer icon. Then go to the home directory. And then right click your home directory, select properties on the menu. On the permissions tab, change the others access, from none, to access files. That's it. We have now configured our Ubuntu desktop to share our directory. To test, let's create a sample file and save it to the shared directory. Let's navigate to the shared directory to verify that the file was actually saved. Before we can go to our Windows 11 desktop, we need to know first the IP address of our Ubuntu desktop. To do that, click on the network icon on the top right of the menu bar. And then click on the wired connected and select wired settings. You will then be presented by the network settings window. Click on the gear icon of your network connection. On the details, you will see the IP address of your Ubuntu desktop. Record this IP address because we will use this to access the shared directory from the Windows 11 desktop. Moving to the Windows 11 desktop, open your file explorer. And at the location bar, input the IP address of your Ubuntu desktop. In my case, as we checked earlier, the IP address is 192.168.1.59. If you followed all the procedure correctly, you should be able to access the Ubuntu shared directory. That's all for now. Drop me your feedback and comments below. If this video helped you in any way, please like share and subscribe. Thank you.